Okay, so this is a review of the Utilitech brand surge protector. And it's designed to help reduce the amount of power loss resulting from vampire Brought power. to you by the website www.allabouthomeelectronics.com which is the uh, amount of electricity that electronic devices will use uh, to maintain themselves in a standby position. In other words, if you have electronics in your home theater system and you, you turn them off, or you, you think you turn them off, you, you actually have turned them off, but they're still going to vampire a little bit of electricity to um, keep themselves functioning in the background. And this power strip is going to automatically sense when the electrical current stops flowing because you stopped using the device and it's going to turn the outlet off and they're claiming here on the package it can save you up to fifty dollars per year on your electric bill and that is of course if you're utilizing most of the uh, outlets that are shown here on the package which is a total of six out outlets. Now one of the outlets is always energized because you have to be able to turn a device on in order to activate the other outlets. And um, the other nice thing about this particular surge suppression strip, which a lot do, is it provides you uh, some sort of warranty protection in the event that you have damage to your electronics from an electrical storm or an electrical spike. But you got to register, you know, when you install this and do everything properly. Otherwise, that uh, protection is not available to you. This particular unit, we're going to pull it out of the box and take a quick look at it. Okay, so we've removed the surge suppression from its packaging, and it is a total of 15 inches in length, and it is two and a half inches in width here, and then it looks like it's just over an inch tall. And it comes with a six foot electrical cord, and here is what the plug looks like. Now, you might be thinking to yourself, well, that's kind of odd. Why are you pointing out what the plug looks like? Uh, it's not a flat plug, it's a regular straight up plug that sticks way out from the wall. So, if you were going to try to plug this into a wall outlet behind an electronic cabinet, you know, you have to give yourself an extra two and a half inches for that plug. That's why I point that out. So it has a built-in reset button on the side in case it's ever activated. It is grounded and you can select between the energy saving mode, which is what we're going to wind up doing, or you can turn it to where it's just in the surge protection mode. Regardless, in either mode, it's in surge protection mode. So they've labeled the receptacles here and the one that you have to really pay close attention to is the main receptacle. This is the one that always stays energized that means that whatever's plugged into that is going to always have some vampire power trickling to it but that's important because when you turn that device on with your remote control you want it to come on and then all the other receptacles will power up so again they're advertising this thing can save you up to fifty bucks per year not to mention the protection during electrical storms or electrical surges from you know a variety of sources that, that ends this video we think this is a great product uh, the price on this was $40. We picked it up at a big box retailer. Uh, you should be able to find it there as well. Thanks for watching. Brought to you by the website www.allabouthomeelectronics.com. For more information on this topic or other topics pertaining to home electronics, visit the website by clicking the link located directly below this video.